I think you'll agree that what makes this question kind of difficult and annoying is the fractions in the question itself. The fact that we have b plus 1 in the denominator and b in the denominator. So uh, it might be a good idea to zoom in to that question stem by those factors. Let's zoom in by a factor of b and also zoom in by a factor of b plus 1 uh, just to start simplifying what the question is really asking. So once we multiply both sides of the equation by b and also by b plus 1, we end up on the left side with ab minus b and on the right side with ab plus a. So it might be a good idea at this point to subtract ab from both sides of the equation and we're just left with is negative b equal to a. In other words, are a and b mirror images on the number line? Are they uh, on opposite sides of zero but equidistant from zero? Now statement two says exactly that. It says that a and b are mirror images of one another on the number line, so statement two is sufficient on its own and we can eliminate ACE. Statement one, on the other hand, uh, doesn't really tell me where uh, A and B are on the number line, it just tells me how far apart they are on the number line. Uh, but I have no idea which side of zero, are they both on the same side of zero, opposite sides of zero, how far from zero, I can't say anything about that. So statement one on its own is not sufficient and the correct answer is B. If you like this approach, be sure to check out my book, it's all in there. What do you want me to talk about in my next video? Type it down in the comments below and maybe I'll make a video just for you. Make sure you're subscribed and click that little bell icon below so you don't miss any future videos. See you next time!